You probably opened Premiere Pro 2025 just to discover that the timeline looks completely different and you can hardly navigate the new layout. Don't worry, in this video, I'll show you how to switch back to the classic look. First, the colors in the timeline are different, so let's change that by going to Premiere Pro, Settings, and Labels. If you're on Windows, this setting should be under Edit, Preferences, and then Labels. In the drop-down menu at the bottom, select Classic, then click OK. That's going to reset the colors of the blocks. If you look at the audio clip, you see that the colors are inverted. If you don't like that, you can switch the label color to green, which looks more like the previous versions of Premiere. To apply this change for all future projects, go back to Settings and Labels, where you can change the color of all audio clips to green. The next thing you might want to disable are these lines showing for each block if you want to hide them. Open the Timeline Display Settings on this wrench icon and uncheck Show Video Keyframes. Click on the wrench icon again and uncheck show audio keyframes to apply the same change for the audio blocks. Next, if you want to adjust the height of all the video and audio tracks, you can do so by holding shift and dragging the lines between two video tracks. That's going to adjust the settings for all video rows. Then you have to make the same change to the audio tracks. So hold shift and drag between two rows. In order to change these settings for future projects, you have to create a preset. For that, click the wrench icon, choose save preset, type a name and hit OK. Now, whenever you want to go back to those settings, you can click the wrench icon and choose the preset from the menu. One last change you might notice is that the Essentials Graphics window is missing. That's because Adobe replaced that window with the Properties panel. That's where you can find and modify all of your settings. That's all for this video, guys. Let us know if there's anything else you'd like us to cover in future videos. If you want to learn more, check out this other video on the screen. Thank you and see you next time. This is Creative Society.